What a night, ladies and gentlemen, that we have in store for you tonight. I'm Michael Cole, alongside the Hall of Famer, Jerry the King Lawler. And you know, Michael, I've been looking forward to this night for a very long time. Let's get it on. This one should be great, and it's just going to keep getting better as the night goes on. Well, that's the first time we've seen that move tonight from either locker room. I kind of love it. Tell me your thoughts on Summer Rae. I'll tell you, she's not at all timid when it comes to competing inside that ring, guys. It might be too early to tell, but it seems to me that Summer Rae has brought her A-plus game here tonight. And it's a good thing, because this isn't tiddlywinks. It's the WWE, and you're not going to survive in the WWE unless you're filled with aggression. Oh, Summer Rae's impressive in many, many ways. Her ability to go from quick strike to full-on assault is incredible. Summer's also studied the history of this business and knows tons of painful maneuvers and submission holds. Make no mistake about it, Summer's quickness, brains, and mean streak makes her lethal in that squared circle. What a shot by Nia Jax. Here's Nia Jax with some offense of her own. And she pulls a new trick from her bag with that one. Looks like Summer Rae is waning a bit. She needs to find a way to get back on the offensive here. Uh -huh. Can she end it here? Oh, and there's the kick out, avoiding the loss. Man, that was close, though. Well, I got to tell you, I thought she was done there. Summer Rae attacks every opponent like she's gaining retribution for a personal vendetta. Summer's aggressive fast and knows how to use We got a cover. Jax comes up big with that victory. Here's your winner, Nia Jax. Man, what a contest. We definitely just witnessed one for the ages. I'll remember that one for a long time. Few things.